And welcome back to The Factor on Censored. Harris County Judge Lena Hidalgo caught having what we call a very factor on censored moment during a commissioner's court meeting. She got fired up while criticizing the group about District Attorney Kim Og, even dropping the F-bomb. Let's take a vote and let's be on the record who wants it to go where so that I can then go explain to my community what else we're doing because some of us are wrapped around the little finger of a woman who I don't know what the f she's threatened you with. Yes. So I Whoa. think. My next guest has more on the source of Judge Hidalgo's frustrations. Let's take a listen. And joining us now here on The Factor Uncensored is attorney Oliver Brown. Oliver, what the hell is going on at commissioner's court? Did the county judge Lena Hidalgo go too far by dropping the F-bomb? Obviously, she'd be welcomed here on The Factor with it, but <laughs> we're talking about in the real world of politics and doing it so publicly. Your thoughts on that? Look, when, when, when Donald Trump ran for office, he started using the word BS and, and some other, you know, uh, not so popular words. Uh, I think she got emotional about it. But I also think there was a lot of uh, concern in, in her voice about, about this program. Uh, the program, it seems to be designed to really help the community. Uh, you know, you have activists out there and, and, and people that are tied to the community. Hey, Quan LX, excellent guy, right? He could be considered an interrupter. He goes in and resolves disputes between police in the community all the time. There, uh, recently, Jerry Monroe, who died, um, he, he got called out on a scene maybe about three or four weeks before he died where some people didn't want to come out the house, and he was able to come out there. That program is set up for, for things like that, but it still needs to have its independence. And, and really uh, quick, for those who don't know exactly what the program is you're talking about, explain it a little bit in depth so that the viewer can get it. Sure. So it's a program set up to where to help reduce community violence through alternative means. And that alternative means is usually getting connected with people that are in the local communities in various hoods and, and neighborhoods or whatever that are known to probably be older. They may have used to be in the gang life, but they're no longer in, but they still have the street respect so that they could come in and talk and get people to quash small beef before they end up becoming, you know, um, you know, overly large and end up into resulting in some type of violence. And so it, it, it appears that Lena just wanted that to remain an independent and not put it under the DA's office because the DA's office and you're working with them, you lose you lose trust in the neighborhood because people start thinking you're a snitch or something of that nature. Whereas this program allows people to be uh, be independent, yet still maybe receiving some type of compensation from the county to help resolve the dispute. And I think she was very concerned about the safety of those individuals. And as you 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 hinted at in the beginning, that Donald Trump kind of changed the the, the lay of the land when it comes to protocol, uh, the way many politicians talk. So this would be okay, in your opinion, for her. And well, would it be any different for a man if a man did it? I, I don't I don't see gender being an issue here. Nobody nobody should ridicule her just because she's a lady saying the F word. We know that we all have used Im improper language at times. And sometimes when you're very passionate, when you're very passionate about what you believe in, it slips. We've had incidents on the air. Uh, so it just happens. We're still humans. Just because she's um, you know, the, the commissioner doesn't mean that she's still not a human. So, so no one I mean, should hold this against her. It shows that she was passionate about this issue. Yeah, she was passionate and used an improper word. And and quite honest, our our politics are getting very charged in Harris County. There's a lot of backroom stuff going on, and she's concerned. And she just aired her grievance. So I don't see anything wrong with what she did. All right, Attorney Oliver Brown, we appreciate your time and stay away from those F words, those F bombs. <laughs> you know, <laughs> we'll let you get away with a few here on the factor, but not the F word. <laughs> I got you. We have to maintain some sort of standards here, sir. We do. <laughs> I never say any bad words.